Hello there, Easy Webinar fans. This is Skip Foster coming to you live right now inside of YouTube. And I have a couple of updates that have happened recently. We're going to start doing these on a regular basis. You may be hearing from me uh, several times a week, maybe even a couple times a day, which would be great because the truth is we actually push a lot of things into development inside of Easy Webinar, but we neglect to tell you. So this is what we're starting here now is our series of being able to really quick just take a couple of minutes and let you know what's new today uh, or within the last couple of days that we haven't announced recently. So we're starting with a huge one, which you can see at the top of the level is Go High Level. Uh, amazing. So all of you Go High Level users in version two. Now, if right now it is only programmed in version two, um, if you are in version one, right at this moment, we don't have access to it and we may or may not actually do it over there because eventually version one is going away and being sunsetted. We're trying to get everybody over to version two. So at this moment, high level works and it's functional. It'll pass over customers and tags uh, for you to be able to do all your automations and things that you need to do in, in high level. However, right now it is only available in version two of easy webinar if any questions about that just uh, contact support uh, we fixed a bug there was a bug with uh, some incorrect analytics uh, information inside of the dashboard that has been fixed we also had a bug where there were some of the before event notifications not sending under certain circumstances and uh, that has all been resolved and fixed and then another big one of mine because i use this personally is custom fields in Zapier. Uh, in version two, we're not passing through. They were working in version one, but if you were a Zapier user in version two and you used custom fields in your registration form, uh, you probably noticed that they weren't showing up. That has been fixed as well. So now custom fields will pass through from your version two, uh, your easy webinar next. Um, uh, integrations into Zapier. And by the way, if you're not using Easy Webinar Next version two of Easy Webinar, you need to do that. If you go back to your home menu, if you're in the old legacy version that we're now calling it, of Easy Webinar, and go back to the home dashboard on the very top, there's a banner. It says Explore Now. Hit that Explore Now, and that'll take you over to all the awesome things we have in the new version. And we encourage you to explore that and get over there and test that. By the way, we have office hours every single day. Uh, weekday Monday through Friday I'm not I'm not around Saturday and Sunday but twice a day believe it or not twice a day uh, noon and four Eastern time and uh, the the login to be able to get into that is let me think what it is easywebinar.com forward slash office hours that link will get you into the zoom room at noon and four uh, for office hours and you can be able to ask me any questions if you're stuck with something you need help with strategy or how to use easy webinar for this or that how to get traffic to your website how to talk to people in your messaging whatever it is you have about webinars any kind of questions twice a day you can contact me or you can talk to me inside of a uh, open zoom room in office hours that's easywebinar.com forward slash office hours is the link you want to use okay We'll come back again, uh, hopefully maybe even tomorrow, with some more updates from Easy Webinar. Thanks for watching.